Troya v. Frege. Hero v. Lucario. Very interesting, but it could get very goofy very fast. And there we have it. Snooze connects. I'm sleeping, but I'm awake because Breeze could potentially lose this first game. This first set, rather. I'm asleep at the wheel, but that's okay. Because it could be Frege winning today. Or Troya. Probably Troya. Nobody's interested. Everybody's watching Cruz. Except for me. Absolutely crazy connections. Could have been shield breaks on either end. I had a good day. Why am I so tired? It's totally not the ludicrous amounts of cheese quesadillas I had today. I totally forgot to report who won the last set. Wow. I'm just going to let this play through. 
Y'all are gonna have to guess for yourselves if you're coming in. I can't be damned enough. I'm so out of it. It's crazy. Yes, young clout god. I am, as the youngins say, sweepy. I can't be damned enough to commentate this goofy ass match. You're just going to have to take my word that this isn't even the real match because whoever wins... What's the site score right now? Okay. Thank you. There we go. I promise. I promise. I won't call it the Frucario. I refuse to say it in a non referential context. Yo, we got some raw music. Nah, Dreamland. Listen, listen. They chose to go Dreamland. I have no say in it. Yes, yes, this is literally stated on stream earlier. This is literally stated on stream earlier. Me and Joey said this on stream earlier. The right platform is wider than the left, yes. And it's like that in alt as well as melee. It's so goofy. I literally wasn't watching stream really. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm a very I'm a very abrasive person. I know that for a fact. I'm also as they say sweepy. You know, your boy snagged a fight stick for seventy five short curly hair. No, I am not. I am the dweeb who shows up wearing a baseball cap and always wears shorts. Always. Um, who's commentating right now? This is Bowser B. I don't play Smash. I participated in one nut and 102. What's on the baseball cap? The Red Sox, because I'm from around here and my grandmother got it for me for a Christmas gift. I don't care what the baseball cap says. If it said Yankees, I'd still wear it. Who cares if it's the equivalent of wearing a MAGA hat around here? Purple Paradox, you don't understand. I'm very ambivalent about sports ball. Wee cool, goofy little, goofy, goofy, goofy on reflect. Goofy on reflect. Oh, how many, how many bad plays are gonna be made tonight? Uh, I dislike you as a person for using the phrase sports ball. The closest thing, listen, listen, listen. The only time I care about any sports ball is whenever Benfica plays sporting uh, in football. 
European football, obviously, because those are two Portuguese teams. What about esports ball? Um, I I have watched Rocket League and enjoyed it. I wouldn't say that I'm exactly completely attuned to it, but I know it exists, and I have watched it for fun at times. Um, what are some other esports balls? Wind jammers, if that counts. Lethal League Blaze is pretty fun. Uh, EA Sports can go rot in the 10th circle of hell. Any esports? Um, well, I mean, you did say esports ball, so I had to give sports based esports. But in terms of any esports, I'm more of a fighting game guy. Um, my most notable achievement yet was getting third place at a Sailor Moon S monthly last week. It was a completely free bracket, except for the two people who beat me. But you know what? I take those. My next challenge is to try and figure out how to use my high tier to beat the unequaled top, top number one tier. I don't know. <laughs> we got the Pink Panther on the board. Anyways, um, yeah, no. I also play a lot of other FGs, uh, a lot of classic Street Fighters, anything Third Strike and below. I've probably played, yes, even SF1. Um, I also play a bit of uh, Dark Starters 3 slash Vampire Savior, uh, Guilty Gear Plus R. I did recently acquire Blaze Blue Central Fiction and uh, Uniclair. I know Uniclair is surprisingly popular among uh, Smashy Bros players. Um, so, if Smashy Bros players need, you know, non-Smashy Bros fighting game suggestions um, based on uh, based on popularity among Smashy Bros players, I'd say Uniclair. I play a bit of old Melty Blood. Um, I'm not especially good at it. I only play it because the community edition is free and has rollback. But that's whatever. See, I'm having a lot more fun telling you about myself. It doesn't mean I'm narcissistic if I'm having more fun talking about myself. It means that this set just really doesn't matter. I probably skipped someone else winning this. But like, hey, Mr. B, I have spoken with Mr. B about uni. Um, he's an Oriye man. I made Akatsuki, and uh, he forgot to bring his setup today. We were going to run some casuals. We were going to run some goofy little sets just to, like, uh, brush ourselves up. But uh, unfortunately, Mr. B did not bring his setup, and I do not have a laptop that can run Uniclair. I, I'm i planning on getting a Steam Deck soon, as it'd be really nice to compliment my goofy 10-ish year old ThinkPad. As opposed to, you know, just getting a gaming laptop. Freeze up to one. Okay, I will take your word for it. Who cares if it's wrong? I trust you, chat. I trust you. Thanks, young clout god. Uh, I don't care. I don't care about this match. Who cares? Freeze, Troya, if you're watching this, I am so sorry. I just don't care about this match. I will probably be more enthusiastic for the match between you and whoever plays uh, Keenan. But I really, really just don't care right now. I don't care right now. I don't care. Oy, oy, oy. Anyways, what if I actually, what if I actually said stuff based on the match. Huh? Is Frieza's Lucario going to take this? Who knows? Well, first off, Frieza's Lucario needs to get this stock. Barely whiffs the neutral B. Woo! Goofy grab. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Thwack could have done it. Oh, 
Where is his other eye? <laughs> Come on, Fukario, just win this. I want this to be over. I'm moving for free so that it's over. Troy is getting buffs. Troy, I really think he jammed Karata Berry over here. Oh, what a goof! What a goof! What a fake out. What a goofy little fake out. No! No, we have to play one more set before we get to loser semis. No! I'm so out of it. I'm so goofed right now. I'm so goofed. Uh, I'm not. E I'm not even like regular tired. Oh crap! New manga chapter out. Yo, new Kaoru Hana Warin Tosaku and JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Um, Crazy Diamonds. Uh, ba 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 ba. -ba. Crazy Diamonds Demonic Heartbreak. Um, for reference, Karuhana Warin Tosaku is 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 a stupid stupid shonen rom com because I'm a fan of stupid shonen rom coms, but it's not as stupid as the most stupid shonen rom coms. It's, a, it's about a guy who goes to a delinquent school and a girl who goes to a to a to a sort of like like girls school with like prestige and shit, but they don't really give a shit because the dude the dude makes cakes and shit. And the girl likes eating the cakes. I wonder if it'll ever be a plot point that she gains weight from eating the cakes. Because that's sort of what normally happens if you eat a lot. People don't know proper health these days, all I'm saying. Your boy lost like 50 pounds in the course of two years. And it was all because of Stetson East. Can we give a shout out to Stetson East? Best weight loss treatment I've ever had. And uh, Crazy Diamond Demonic Heartbreak is a uh, Dojin series of the JoJo's Bizarre Adventure franchise, written by the same person who did Purple Haze Feedback, I believe, if you've ever heard of that one. Um, it sort of expands on the stories of Josuke and Whole Horse, weirdly enough. I mean, who, who doesn't love Whole Horse? I love Whole Horse. I play Whole Horse in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, the fighting game. Uh, anyways, Karuhana Orinto Saku coming out. Uh oh, uh oh. All the all the girls in the girls' school are seeing the cup the couple together. Man, they're all they're all scared. They're, they're all they're all shitting and pissing themselves. Yes, go. Through. 